please subscribe to this channel and also turn on your notification bell in order to get the latest updates. United Nations Human Rights Working Group has called for the immediate and unconditional release of the separatist leader Sisiku Julius Ayuktabem and his co-accused. The decision was adopted by the Working Group on Arbitrary Detention at its 94th session. According to the UN, the detention of the separatist leader and his co-detainees is arbitrary. Vanessa Mafokin. According to the document that sanctioned the 94th session of the United Nations Working Group on Arbitrary Detention, the deprivation of liberty of Sisiku Ayuk Tabem, Wilfred Tassan, Ngala Ufo Ufo, Blair Sevizem, Elias Ebai, Fidelis Ndeche, Egbert Ntui Ogok, Henry Tatakimeng, and Chiel Gossina Warsum is in violation of the Universal Declaration of Human Rights as well as international convention relating to civil and political rights and is therefore arbitrary. Similarly, the UN Working Group says that the rights of the Nera 10 leaders have never been respected, neither by the Nigerian nor the Cameroonian governments. The group recounts that Sisiku Ayutabem and his nine co-accused were abducted on the 5th of January 2018 at Nera Hotel in Nigeria, detained under inhuman conditions and forcefully deported to said in Cameroon during the first six months of their detention as a Secretariat of State for Defense. The UN Working Group on Arbitrary Detention says the 10 individuals were tortured, bundled in minute cells, infested by mosquitoes, rodents, cockroaches, ants, lizards, and so on. They were not let out of their cells that had no windows or ventilation, except on few occasions in the middle of the night for interrogation. The UN regrets that despite a ruling by the Federal High Court of Nigeria in 2019 that the arrest and exportation of Sisiku and Co. was illegal and that individuals should be returned to Nigeria, the Nigerian government is yet to react. The same applies to the Fundi High Court in Yaoundé that reportedly threw out a habeas corpus on behalf of the 10 NERA leaders without a hearing. All efforts by the UN to have the Nigerian and Cameroonian governments react on the state of detention of Sisiku Ayutabe and Co. have been futile. The 10 were sentenced to life in prison in 2019 by a military court for secession and tourism. Vanessa Mafoken reporting in her the fifth phase of the